the College Football World Cup, 63 games, to crown a champion. Highlights of Game 3, Group 3, second-ranked TCU versus ninth-ranked Tulane. So the kicking team is on the field. They'll try for three. TCU is looking to go up by three. The kick is up, and it splits the uprights. Quarterback all by himself in the backfield with five wideouts. Quick strike, and it's caught for the touchdown. Tulane is up four. It has the distance, and he got it. Low scoring first half of play, but a close game. He gets it up, and it's long enough, and it's good. They're trying to stop the run here with a goal line defense. Touchdown, Greenway. And this is the 11th play of the current drive. Pitch it as the quarterback's able to run it in. I'll tell you what, when you're a quarterback and the goal line is right there, it's pretty hard to pitch the ball when you think you can get in. That's a smart decision to keep it for the score. And the quarterback stays on the field as they try for the two-point conversion. They come out in a five-wide set. And they won't get the two. Here in the fourth quarter and behind, they're not going to get many more chances. And now it's third down in a mile. We have less than a minute to go. Deep ball, laying it out there. Touchdown. And now they're winning this ball game. The Horned Frogs knew they had a star quarterback. He came through for them in the clutch. And this defense knows how good this quarterback is. In fact, that's why they decided to try to get as much pressure on him as they could. They weren't able to get home, leaving him plenty of time to make the throw, and he delivered when he needed to. Empty backfield, quarterback in the gun. Five wide receivers. He's got to throw it in a hurry. They don't get it. It all comes down to this. One last chance to throw one up and see if somebody can bring it down and win the game. Incomplete. TCU, 18. Tulane, 17. That does it for this edition of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk Herbstreit, I'm Brad Nessler saying so long. TCU rallies late for the victory. Subscribe for highlights of the next game, Michigan versus Clemson.